of Eden today. And uh, have a look at what Eden's like last stop before Sydney. You had been with a good girl like me in a few market stores, but handmade stuff. Uh, tourist information, a bit of food. And I had control in the driver's seat. And the boats will bring you in, they'll drop you off just here. Uh, and then there's a shuttle bus to the town. If you don't want to do the shuttle bus and you want to walk, there's a footpath that zigzags through these trees and goes up to the town which is up the top of a hill and it is quite an incline. The other option is to come down this path and walk for about 4k to a viewpoint. It's in secret this one. So if you do want a beach and it's only about 20 minutes from the ship, it is a bit of uneven walking, it's quite steep um, initially. But you can come and sit on this beach all day, there's no one going to stop you. I used to be chill, now I can't catch my breath. When you say my name, I feel tight in my chest. Can't handle the space. I need you here by my side. You make me sweat in the coldest of nights. Yeah. Just freezing. I'm not in yet. I'm absolutely freezing. Which is off on one again. But I'll support my wife by getting frozen. Here it goes. Coffee shops and delicatessen. We have two colours here if anybody's wanting anything from those one either side of the road, the Eden uh, News Agency and Post Office. There's two off shops in the area on the road there. Another shop that I'll let just make mention of coming up on our left, Art on Inlay. A lot of talented people around the area to display and sell their goods in there just on our left now. So this is our final stop before we go back to your ship and to the wharf area. There is Wi-Fi here at the back. And anybody that wants to walk back to the Killer Whale Museum, if you are light now and just continue straight ahead. And you can then join a shuttle bus every 15 or 20 minutes.